Hello, dear ones, it's Alice. I am of the stars. Um, I thought I'd tell you about a vision I had years ago, uh, the same year that my mother passed on, right after she passed on. Um, I, I had an experience um, of very deep soul anxiety many years ago then. Um, I felt that I, I remember lying in bed for three days feeling that I couldn't move and that there was nothing, uh, that there was nothing at all that I could do about it. And that had to do with the experience of deep grief that I was feeling. And during that time, those three days, from which I eventually arose a completely different person, um, during that time of transition, I had uh, a very deep vision one night, I fell into a vision of, of being in a time tunnel and of experiencing a, a lifetime, not the current lifetime, but another lifetime as sound, as sounds of uh, rites of passage. And there were only four uh, and, and those summed up the entire lifetime. Uh, I heard the wail of, an, of a baby being born, the first cry of a child. I heard uh, the ecstatic cry of a woman uh, during intercourse as she climaxed. I heard uh, her, her cry out in anguish as she gave birth. And I heard the last sob of breath as she passed on from physical into astral form. And those sounds disappeared down the tunnel of time that I, uh, that I envisioned. They disappeared and whirled away. It was an incredible experience. Ever since then, I've um, I've taken into account what this society so frequently overlooks: the milestones of the evolution of a, of a human life. And I feel that in future, uh, these these milestones will receive more recognition through ceremony uh, in human society, and and. Surely it should be so that the entire community w would recognize the child uh, reaching puberty, the, the right of union, whether it be through marriage or however it should evolve in future, and, and the, um, the right of birth. That's another wonderful experience that deserves, uh, it deserves uh, nurturing from some people in the community helping uh, a, a pregnant woman and helping after the birth, I feel, and honoring that experience so that the child can have a good start in life. Um, and the right of death, that that should no longer be veiled in secrecy, but celebrated in joy. So uh, that's, that's my story for the moment. God bless you all.